Now this illustration deals with the laundry circuit. In accordance with the requirements of 220.52b, 210.11c is in car 2, and 210.52f uh, is in fun. Now we reviewed in Stalkup's volume 1 of Stalkup's electrical design book the location of these outlets and uh, how the laundry could circuit could feed certain outlets and other outlets it could not supply, such as the lighting outlets. So we're not going to be covering that right now. We already covered it. But notice the uh, laundry circuit requires one 20-amp circuit. And that one 20-amp circuit is worth 1,500 VA. Just as the small plant circuits are uh, calculated at 1,500 VA each. But this laundry circuit is one 20 amp circuit, and you would uh, figure it at 1500 VA, and you're going to pick that up in the sections that you see listed under the caption uh, laundry circuit. Now, we, as, as I just pointed out, we, we've already covered receptacle locations in the volume one of Stalkup's electrical design book. So uh, remember that you have at least two small plant circuits, 1500 VA each, and one laundry circuit at 1500 VA uh, requirement, and they are added together. So we will be putting more of this, uh, these requirements uh, together as we go along. But what we're trying to point out here as an electrician or designer or inspector either, you can come to uh, and review this chapter 14 and pick up the procedure to calculate the loads in VA or amps uh, for any particular piece of equipment uh, that's installed in a dwelling unit, as well as taking square footage and figuring what the VA would be. Uh, and we'll be doing this kind of thing as we move on through these illustrations. So now let's move to the next illustration.